When most of us die, all we can reasonably expect is a mention in the local obituaries or maybe a small headstone with a simple inscription. However, most of us are not Isaac Newton. In 1784, some 60 years after the death of this revolutionary physicist, French architect Louis Bouilly decided that wherever Newton was currently buried was not a fitting tribute to the great man and his achievements. To that end, he set about designing something a little more breathtaking. According to a BBC article, to quote, at 500 feet or 150 meters, the cenotaph would have been the tallest built structure in the world overshadowing the then tallest building, Strasbourg Cathedral, at 446 feet, and the Great Pyramids of Giza at 455 feet. This incredible monument had one outstanding feature. Many years before the advent of the first planetarium, Bully carefully designed the surface of the dome with thousands of tiny holes that would replicate the constellations during the day. Not only that, but due to the single bright light contained within the structure, the effect would be mirrored on the outside of the dome at night. Sadly, although the plans were completed by Bully, the structure was never built.